Hello, this is Thibaut for another animation tutorial video. So today we're gonna see a title rotation animation. So let's see what it looks like. Um, actually, this is from an example. So this is this one is not my animation. I, I will show it what I've done later. Um, it was in the motion page group that somebody has uh, a question to see if it was possible to replicate this animation uh, from this, I don't know, Hazel theme template. And uh, I could replicate it, so maybe I will change the screen size so you can see it better. Okay, so I won't describe the animation on this one. I will show you what I've done, but it's pretty similar because I'm using the same background um, video and uh, more or less the same uh, text. So as you can see, there are three uh, lines or words, not words, but lines that are rotating having the letter um, going up and down and uh, I, maybe you can't see it well but there is also a fade in fade out of the letter what is coming in or coming out of um, the screen um, yes so i've done it with uh, bricks as usual and with motion page but i will provide with the uh, uh, bricks forge template later on so in bricks quite simple um setup i have two uh, section one having the animation itself um so basic text for the title upwards then i have the 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 most interesting one is the setup for the tight rotating titles so it's actually a simple div um which i put three heading on absolute position and uh i've set up a certain height for the um, typography and the container is also not the same size but one ram more on top and on the bottom so if my heading is 10 uh, for the font size my layout for the parent is 12 rem so from 10 to 12 so to give a bit some space to see the letter moving up and moving down so and there are some buttons but that's not really important so let's move to the motion page so i thought initially the animation will be quite simple but actually it's quite complex <laughs> um so what i'm using basically is a scroll trigger and i'm using a toggle action play pose play pose so a custom one so when it gets out of the screen it's posing and when you are coming back into the screen it's replaying again so you don't have animation uh, running all the time when you are on the on the page if you are not on the animation itself um then so i have if you remember i have three titles so to animate the first one i'm using uh nth child one because it's the first uh i gave the heading the same uh class ok okayama split title you see they have all the th the same so it can be used you can use the the same for re uh, a repeater you will give a class to the heading and it will be repeated the, the class will be repeated so in 
motion page or bricks forge would be the same the the by using s and child you can target every um, repeated element so um, okayama speed title the nth child one then there is i'm um, animating the nth child two and then the nth child three but for this one um what i'm doing is basically i'm splitting the text by characters and i'm giving a class so title dash one that's what that's wo how i'm able to uh, animate through css and through motion page also the uh, having the letters from odd and even it's a, 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 a you can see on my screen the nth child odd of the title one will go up and the even will go down so I'm repeating again okay okay i'm a split title and child one i'm splitting the text by characters i'm giving a class and i'm to be able to start the the let's say the splitting of the letters i need to put a value on the stagger doesn't matter how much it will have an, any impact on the animation itself but i'm putting the bare minimum so 0.01 second and from start but that doesn't matter much then i'm animating the title one class that i just created and using the nth child odd so the, fir the thir first three five seven nine eleven letters while the even will be the second fourth six eighth tens etc so the odd i'm translating upwards so 100 percent and the even opposite minus 100 percent translating and also as you can see i'm doing a bit of opacity i don't know if you can see well but when the again there is a slight fade in fade out so for this um, I, i've added an opacity on the uh, on the end child on the odd and even and i'm repeating that for okayama split title the number two and child two i'm giving the class title two and then i'm repeating the animation so entering and get and getting out then the n child three i'm giving the class title three then the same the title three n child odd and n child even i'm animating those property those classes let's say those pseudo sorry uh, pseudo elements so uh, i will uh, as usual share the template so you can have it for yourself and play with it i will prepare uh, also later on um, a version for bricks forge thank you for watching see you at another video bye